Hi all, in this video we are going to discuss about the things to check while we are purchasing an order app from the order app store. So currently I am uh, in the order app store. Uh, as we know order is the one step uh, resolution for uh, all your business needs and the order apps are the custom made support application for various aspects of business in order. And you can see various applications uh, with the custom modules here. And in the app store, you can see the custom made application for various uh, business organization. And here you can see we have both the free apps and also the paid apps available here. And in case of free apps, uh, you can directly uh, download, like uh, you can directly download and use it in your system. So you can filter out the free apps directly by clicking on this free filter. So you can see the free apps available here. And for the paid apps, you can click on this paid. Uh, so in case of paid apps, you have to purchase it. Uh, so in this video, we are going to discuss about the things or uh, the things that we have to take care of uh, while purchasing an order apps. So these are all the paid apps available uh, in order apps store by the side process. And now let's see what are the things that we have to take care of. And the first and uh, most important thing is the version of the module. Let's see, let's take a module dynamic financial reports here. So here you can see this module is a paid module and you can also see the pricing of this module here. Okay, the first and most important thing uh, while uh, you are purchasing a particular paid up module is the version of the module. So here you can see the available version of this module. Uh, from version 10, 12, 13, 11, and 14 versions are available here. So suppose uh, you are using order version 14, you have to check uh, whether the module that you are going to purchase is available in order version 14 or not. Uh, only then uh, this particular version is available, you can directly purchase. Otherwise, it will not be suitable for your system. So like that, you have to take care while choosing the specific version. Suppose you are uh, choosing the uh, using the version uh, version tool, you have to click this version tool, and you can directly uh, purchase this module directly from here by clicking on this add to cart. And the next important thing uh, is the features of this module. That is whether this uh, uh, features of this module support our requirements or not. So for that, you can check the index of the module. So in the index tab, uh, the order uh, might have specified the key features and then the features available, uh, key highlights, and then the configuration part of this particular module and the features and the screenshot uh, implies the working of this module. And also you can check for the uh, video or the demo that they have specified. So based on that, you can determine whether this particular module that you are going to purchase is suitable for your requirements or not. And based on that, you can purchase. And also the one of the most important thing that you have to take care of is the dependencies uh, related with the module that you are going to purchase. So here in the uh, included dependencies, you can see the dependencies related to this dynamic financial reports like this. You can See the included dependencies of all the module. So while purchasing the module, you have to take care whether this uh, dependent module is also uh, available along with this module or whether it is free version or whether it is a paid version. So in case of paid version, you might have to purchase those modules. So you have to take care of all those things while purchasing the module. Also, you can see the license of the module and, the, and in the license tab, you can uh, see the license details. Uh, related to this particular module. Uh, so that are the things that we have to take care of while purchasing a module. So all these requirements are uh, satisfied. You can directly uh, download or uh, you can directly add to cart this module to your cart and then you can directly purchase it and use it in your system. So that's about this video for uh, important things to take care of while purchasing the module from Modo App Store. So that's about this video. Thanks for watching.